Podbean also allows you to use a whole bunch of different layouts for your site. It has a lot of custom templates and things that you can change. So I'm going to go through how to do that today. And I'm here logged into my dashboard and I'm going to click on layout here on the left. And as you can see, this is my current theme, the Front Row 2.0. And as we scroll down, there's a whole lot of different themes. You can kind of get an idea of what they look like and get a description of them. Uh, you can do a larger view if you want to check it out in more detail, um, or you can just activate to try it out for your site. So just as an example, we'll click on this so you can see how it works. And I'm going to activate this pro fitness um, theme for my site. So once I've done that, go to view site. And you can see how that's changed around. So you can play with them or view the, look at the different views and get a feel for what's most appropriate um, for your particular site. So talk about some other options. So let's see, we'll go back down to front row here. So that's the one we had before and click activate on that one. Okay, so it's back to my theme that I had before. Let me just view it to check it out. Yep, back to what we had before. So in this theme, in some of the themes, you can also have the option of changing out the header image um, and the background image. So we're going to show how that works today. So I'm going to put in something that's my own. And when you click on this, you'll see it pops up with the recommended size. So as you're determining your background image, you might need to do a little photo editing or find an appropriate photo. Um, so I've already worked on that. So I'm going to click Upload and Browse here. And then I've already prepared my header image. So I will click on that and click open and allow that to uh, load. Okay, great. So we should have that. So I'm going to view the site just to see that change. So you can see now my own special header image is there in my theme. So we were successful with that. And I'll go back to our settings so we can um, we can also change that piece out. So I'm going to upload a background image and very similar here. Just go and choose my image. I have kind of a light colored background here to give it a little more pizzazz. So upload that and it'll take a couple seconds for that to do. So um, it should be this one here. You can now view the site to make sure we have the Okay, now you can see my header image that I loaded up before was there, and now my background image, it was just a simple change of color from white to kind of this more taupe color. So I've been able to customize that. So um, that's really easy to do with the different themes. So you have a lot of options for making your site look the way you want it to without having to really know any programming or anything really difficult to make your site look great.